Hello everyone. I want to show you how much you can earn using a laptop Gigabyte G5 with RTX 3060 uh, graphic card. Mm. At the beginning, I have to say that I'm a, I do not have any experience in mining. This is my first uh, contact with mining. I'm a totally new one and just put uh, out of the box uh, the laptop and uh, turn it on. I've used a nice hash which is probably very popular between those people who are uh, mining the bitcoins so uh, it's a probably first step for such a people as I am okay so uh, how it looks I've opened that laptop what I've made I turn on the nice hash and it seems that this gigabyte G G5 it's quite efficient Let's just take a look uh, the hash rate I done nothing actually I just turn on it's 39.11 mega hash per second and efficiency is 551 kilo hash per joule and uh, it's taking 70.91 watts which is in my opinion comparing to other laptops it seems to be very efficient so what I've done uh, there is a small uh, pro program gaming center on uh, gigabyte laptops which is implemented and as you can see, uh, first of all, what I've done, I've choose power saving mode. Uh, thanks to that, um, I have uh, 70 watts. If you change the power sa saving to the, the best, let's say, results, which is performance, uh, just take a look what will happen. It was 70 watts, but right now it will go up it will go up uh, to 105 yes as you can see but just take a look the efficiency or uh, drops down extremely and the hash rate is almost on the same level so from my point of view it has no sense just to put the to the performance uh, uh, settings and also just take a look what is going on here I forgot to t to show you at the beginning this is also the implemented program but take a look the temperate temperator temperature uh, of GPU which is a graphic card is rising is going up it was uh, 62 63 before I've changed the mode but I will come back to the power settings say uh, power saving sorry and the temperature should go down yeah you can see it was 76 it's it is 71 right now and it will drop down uh, probably to 64 65 uh, I also do have a second one exactly the same laptop which I put uh, on the pyramid shape uh, it's uh, because of uh, better um, cooling probably I saw this on the internet so but it's working that laptop in this position it has uh, like a 61 uh, Celsius degrees right now when it's standing like that it's like 62 63 uh, so uh, if you are not using the computer you can put it just like that and it's uh, and it will be cooler uh, right now in my house there's uh, 20 Celsius degrees probably this is also important information okay but uh, what's next um, uh, the graphic card is taking 70.62 watts but the whole computer takes uh, more so uh, I've just put it uh, I've just uh, have this computer and I can check how much energy it takes it's 89 or 88 watts at the moment as you can see 89 let's say 89 watts so if you want to know how much the energy costs let's say per day of course it's up to the country where you are I have here uh, information about the costs of energy whole of the world let's say right now I'm in Poland but uh, let's say Great Britain it's the kilowatt hour costs 0 0.22 euros it was uh, in the second half of the previous year so probably it could change because the cost of energy is going up but we can do a we can make a very easy calculation uh, as you saw 
as you saw, it's uh, 80, let's say 89, 88, 89 kilowatts. So what we are doing, we have to apply eight, 88 kilowatts uh, multiplied by 24 hours. So it's 2.11 kilowatt hour per day. So if you have 2.11 kilowatts per day, uh, and if the cost, for example, in the Great in a Great Britain is 0.22 euro per kilowatt, so we are multiplying by 0.22, which means. Uh, which means that the energy cost in Great Britain for that computer is 0.46 euros per day. 0.46 per day. And right now we will open NiceHash. And uh, I'm working right now on that computer, exactly on that computer. And the uh, daily efficiency uh, right now is 2.78 euros per day but of course it's changing it's changing all the time but we have 2.78 the cost of energy is 0 0.46 so when we so we can check how much we are earning per day so minus 2.78 so we are eating two earning 2.31 euros per day when we uh, take uh, take the energy by if we multiply this by three six five days it gives you 845 euros if we will live for one year that computer let's say if bitcoin price will not change etc etc probably may probably impossible but more or less it's a possibility how much you can earn using a uh, gigabyte this computer and also some say that it's very that it's very loud um, so I have a decibel uh, measurement decibel so you can check uh, how loud it is I will be silent for a moment So as you can see, it's something more like 38, 39 decibels, which is uh, not so not so bad, I suppose. And also, I would like to come back to the fans and temperatures. As you can see, when we put that laptop in such a way, just a standard position, the temperature is 65. The temperature is temperature temperature is 65. But for example, this is we are talking about that computer on the first position but on the left uh, this one it has 63 this one but it's in uh, that shape pyramid shape so it's better when it's in a pyramid shape probably some of our, uh, some of you can use MSI burn program or something just to change the mm, the clock or under vaulting computer or something I have not I don't have this knowledge how to do this actually this is the computer which I took off from the box, just put on the table, then on the nice hash, and it's working. From my point of view, from my point of view, it's a quite a good solution. Temperature is temperature is not so high, 65. Also, we have two years guarantee, so I think that if something's happened, uh, I can I can just send the computer just to repair it or something. But 65 degrees for the gaming laptop, I think it's not a bad result. 66, it's acceptable. And the fan is going with almost 50%. Uh, CPU is 59 degrees, not so bad. If you have any advice, what can I do with, uh, with MSI burner, uh, how can I use this program just to improve those results? Would be nice to have those comments uh, under my film. So I wish you a nice day.